So this is a 1981 Craftsman wet shop vac, and I'm gonna fix it up. So all I know about this is this should be screwed down, but screw is gone. And then it's no newer than 1985, which makes it, I mean, I guess it really doesn't matter how much more expensive this might be. It's so old. There's a piece of candy in there. No. Does the filter need to be changed? I would say absolutely. That's disgusting. Before I go any further, I gotta use some tri-flow just to lubricate the th threads because, well, it's old and it's gonna be stuck on there. Honestly, it's just really satisfying to take something that doesn't work, just dab some oil on it and have it come right off. So that's fun too. If I really wanted to, I could easily clean this up. But honestly, I mean, it's a tool. The only thing that does concern me is this seal. I mean, it'll still work without it, but there's nothing here. Um, so now, with a new green filter, which captures general dirt. So I guess that's the cheap kind, but I mean, I don't care. Today. And, well, I think we can see why I got a new one. There's your, as if you needed some examples. I always like to see how things are made. And even though this is the same thing, after 20, 30 years, they've made improvements. So. The new one has, it almost looks like Gorilla Glue or just some foam adhesive, but it holds the filter in much better and probably lowered the cost too. All right, now with the new filter on, I just put cords under that camera, drop the lid back on. One other problem. This is a metal lid because, you know, it's ancient. It's dented. All right, so here's a problem. Because this is steel, um, it dents. You know, we always complain about they don't make things like they used to, but they used to make things out of steel. And steel, like you can see here, it rusted, it dented, and those are problems that plastic will never have a problem with, ever. So I've elected to just use, uh, you know, the cheapest kind of pliers you can get, but what I kind of like I mean, Harbor Freight's great, and I don't want to put them down in any way, but I always like how it's funny now they always use, you know, this is this was before they made stuff in China. That's how old this is. This is U.S. steel, um, made in America, so I don't know. Maybe, maybe to me that's just worth paying extra for. I just like old stuff, you know, and you can buy whatever you want off Harbor Freight, and it's great, but old stuff lasts. So there's probably 954,000 ways to fix this, but why not do it this way? All right. All right, moment of truth. Oh. That fits great. Here it is, a Craftsman vacuum made in the USA, back when you could proudly buy something from Kmart. Some things have changed, but at least we know this has not.